What's up, everyone? My name is Michael, and I help store owners increase their sales and conversions with conversion rate optimization. So this video is going to be a little tutorial on how to get the new Shopify one one page checkout. I can't guarantee it'll work for everyone, but from what I've tested, it's worked on the majority of, of the stores. It's going to require a little bit of coding, but it's super simple and pretty much anyone, anyone can do it. Um, as you can see right here, it's the one page checkout. Uh, and then if we look on mobile, it looks very good. So first thing I suggest everyone to do is duplicate their live theme. So let's say if you mess up anything, you still have a backup of your uh, live theme. And then the next thing you, you do is uh, once you're on the theme editor, on the theme uh, customizer editor, go up here, click the three dots and click edit code. And then once you're on the edit, edit code page in the search bar, search up cart. And then since I'm on the sense theme, uh, you're going to be looking in two places. Uh, each theme is different, but on the new um, 2.0 themes, pretty much everything is the same or similar. So we're looking on the sense theme on the card drawer snippet. And then for the cart page itself, it's going to be called car, uh, main cart items. And the thing that we're looking for on these pages is uh, the form tag. So once you, you can uh, click Command F if you're on Mac, and then just search uh, the this the form. And then once you find this action tag right here, all we're going to do is replace it with this uh, text right here. So action and then slash checkout question mark force underscore checkout equals re redesign. So what basically this means is that it's kind of forcing Shopify checkout to, uh, to do the new rede redesign checkout, uh, if that made any sense. And then same thing, if you're using a cart page itself, um, just search up the form tag. And then again, um, just replace it with the same thing I, I said before, and like just save it. And then we're going to save it again. And then if we go back, uh, let's just refresh this, go on the home page, and then cart, and go to checkout. It's going to be showing the new one page checkout. And it that pretty much so simple to do. Hopefully you got some value out of that. And I also have my own e-commerce Discord server. Um, so if, if you want to join that, I'll leave the link in the description. And if you want to learn more about how to better optimize your store to increase conversions without spending more money on ads, then you can definitely check out my store optimization course that I have over 20 videos on going into detail on each page, like the product page, car and checkout, and much more on how to better optimize your store, talking about each section and what you can do, what what was suggested and what not to do. And then I also released my custom optimized Shopify theme that comes with the course. That it, It's a pretty much optimized uh, theme out of the box with lots of features that most themes don't come with. Um, so you'll be steps ahead of your competitors. And then I'll have everything in the description, like I said. And uh, thanks for watching, everyone.